What's up grubbers? Welcome back to my channel. If you are new to my channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button below. Also hit the post bell notification so you can be notified each time I upload a video. Thank y'all so much for joining me today. As you can see, we are doing the Bell's Palsy Challenge. Bell Palsy Challenge, you may have seen it all over YouTube. It was created by, let me make sure I get her name right because y'all know I would tear up someone's name. <laughs> it was made, it was created by Angela. Her channel is called is she's living her challenge is called she's living and she created the challenge uh, she was actually diagnosed with Bell's palsy recently and I was challenged to this by Deani Eats Deani Eats is also um, battling Bell's palsy she has I think she said 90% recovered and Bell palsy is a condition where one side of your face um, basically it's paralyzed um, paralysis um, you have no your face can go numb granted the eye patch um, one of the symptoms of Bell palsy is dry eye so I have to wear the patch in order to you know support Bell's palsy because of the dry eye is one of the um, conditions of, are one of the symptoms of Bell's palsy along with a lot of other symptoms so I am bringing awareness to Bell's palsy like several other YouTubers have done by wearing an eye patch and um, as you can see also today you guys we have the sausage cucumber and beloved sauce and rice today this was inspired by uh, let me make sure I get her name right. <laughs> Eat with Kim. Uh, she always has a uh, cucumber uh, with her seafood. So that's where this concoction or this combination came from. So I'm going to go ahead and get started. I also have over here some rice seasoning. I got this from my local Korean market and I tried it today and it's really good. It is really, really good. So how are y'all doing today? I hope y'all are having a wonderful day. This is actually mixed with like seaweed and um, other spices. I'm just going to pour a little bit on top like this. And get started because I am starving. Oh, and you guys, today I have a new sparkling water. I tried this Deer Park sparkling water out and it is the black cherry. Yeah, it's the black cherry. So I'm going to go ahead and give y'all some ASMR. I haven't given y'all ASMR in a while, right? And this is really hard, y'all. It's, it's really hard trying to, with this patch over my eye, and I can't really get a good peripheral of what I'm pouring. So you just never know the struggles people go through, you know, when they have different type of conditions medical um conditions that they're battling i was talking did y'all hit asmr sorry about that y'all i was talking but yeah asmr i'm gonna go ahead and get started <laughs> um and like i said over here i just have some beloved sauce y'all and to those of you who've done this um patch over your eye it is hard it is hard but I'm going to do the best I can today I'm going to get some rice I actually had this meal last week and I really enjoyed it. This is such a good combination. It's simple. And this is beef sausage, by the way. Y'all know I don't do pork. Pork sausage. Mm. 
So what are y'all eating with me today? Mm. And a lot of times people get Bell's palsy confused with a stroke. because of the droopiness of one side of the face. So, it kind of looked like a person had a stroke, but in fact, it's Bell's palsy. And I was listening to um, the Honey Eat story a while back ago, and she was saying, you know, one day she woke up and her face was like droopy. And she um, called her mom and I, I think her mom, um, diagnosed her and that's when she went to the doctor and got official diagnosis but I don't think they really have have it narrowed down to what actually causes it I could be mistaken but I don't think it's hereditary I think it's one of those things where anyone can get. And I personally suffer with dry eye at night. So I had to put a special kind of drop in my eye. So I'm familiar with dry eye. But to have Bell's palsy, the dry eye is so extreme, they have to wear a patch. So I know I mentioned that before, but I just want to say that I am familiar with dry eye and it hurts. I'm gonna put a little more rice seasoning on here. I don't know the name of this, y'all, but they had um, they had like wasabi flavor, they had salmon flavor, and this is I cannot pronounce the name of this flavor, but I just got it because it was the one where the most was sold. Like they only had two of these left, so I figured it must taste the best. But it is really good. And this beloved sauce with these onions. Oh my god. Mmm. 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 So good. If y'all have not tried this combination, give it a try. It is so good. This is my second time having it. The first time I didn't film it. But. It was delicious. Mm. Mm. You know, that rice season makes the rice taste like a sushi rice. It makes it taste like sushi. Along with these onions, oh, uh, so delicious and nutritious. <laughs> and the last time I ate this, I had organic cucumbers, and they were so. They had more flavor on it than these. These are not organic, but they're still good. <clears throat> mm. I'm like, I used to always watch Eat With Kim. And like I said, she would have these cucumbers, but I just never thought to try it until I saw all the other YouTubers try And I'm like, let me just see what's going on. They were right, y'all. They were right. It is so good. 
If y'all can find this rice seasoning, like I said, please try it. It'll change your life. If y'all ever made this below, so y'all know the onions and ginger at the bottom. Oh my God, y'all. That's where it's at. I mean, the top is good too, but once you get down and get that flavor that's settled at the bottom. Whew. Yes. I love it. I absolutely love it. And the rice is jasmine rice. Which is one of my favorites. Jasmine and the other rice, I cannot pronounce it, but it starts with a B. Bast Bastam Bastami. I know somebody will correct me. It starts with a B A S T. Bastami. But anyways, it's, I'll either get jasmine or that type of rice. Y'all, these cucumbers are such a good snack. Like, I would eat these, like, with some, um, with some ranch dressing. Just dip them in some ranch dressing, some homemade ranch. Or eat just some Hidden Valley Ranch. Simple. I love simple, healthy snacks. these I cook these sausages in the air fryer I love my air fryer and it cooked them perfectly like the struggles I could not imagine wearing this patch all day and when you put yourself in someone else's shoes it's just you you get a whole new perspective of what people go through like this patch i can't even get a good oh no 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 i can't even get a good feel of how far my food is away from me so i have to lean up and i don't it's just it's just hard and people deal with this every day be thankful for your health Mm. Mm. This is so good. I know I keep saying it, but this is absolutely delicious, y'all. I would have never thought to put, mm, never thought to put this combination together. I wanted to go today and get the um, Popeye's chicken sandwich, but I've been hearing so much about Popeye's and it was a fight at one of the Popeye's here. Like the crew was fighting with, <laughs> the crew were fighting with, like physically fighting with the customers. I saw the video yesterday, I'm like, no, not going to Popeye's. I go right to Chick-fil-A, give me that spicy deluxe, but yeah. Those chicken sandwiches are serious. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. Bomb.
But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and finish this up off camera. I want to thank y'all so much for joining me today. I want to give a huge shout out to everybody fighting silent battles that you don't talk about. I'm fighting mine. Everybody's fighting something. You don't know what people are going through. So I want to give out a shout out to those who just don't talk about maybe physical or mental that people are going through. And if you're not following me on Instagram, go ahead and follow me over there at SheGrowsLove. Oh. <laughs> follow me over there at SheGrowsLove. Also, uh, go to TikTok and follow me over there as well. She grows with love. I'm also on Twitter, but I do not know my Twitter name. But yeah, y'all follow me. Stop me. Follow me everywhere. Um, I'm going to go ahead and get out of here. I thank y'all so much for joining me into the next video. Continue to grow up with love. Peace.